morning um yes i'm going to take the challenge <laughs> Good morning and welcome back to the Wild Cherry Farm. My friend from, from Life in the Wild West, it's another YouTube channel, she started a challenge yesterday um, to post a video every day for 30 days, except for the weekends. And I think I'm taking her up on the challenge and I'm going to try the same. So um, we'll see how it goes. And she wants to post short and sweet videos every day edited b-roll videos and i probably still will make a few of them but i just want to try how it goes with shorter videos without too much editing and what i want to start with today is um i wanted to show you my art supplies um that i use for nature study and even sketching like nature journaling and other journaling so um what i have here i'm going to start with the nature journals themselves so what i use is um i'm going to put links below the video and to these sketchbooks that i buy from amazon they're just very simple they're not even they're not even watercolor or anything. They're just like regular thick paper, a little bit thicker. So this one I actually got in an art supply store in town. And um, that's the one I filled. Yeah. And these ones are my son's nature journals. And um, I have more of them. And so I just got a, another stash of new ones. So these are all empty and I'm looking forward to filling them over the next few weeks and months. And I even thought maybe I will um, take different topics for each of them. So one is my nature journal. That's the new one I just started and I already um, put a drawing into. And then I might do a painting one and an another one where I'm just drawing, sketching from photographs. Um, yeah, so we'll see. I have a few ideas what I want to do with them, but I will see over the next few weeks and I will let you know definitely. The next thing I want to show you are these pencil cases um, that I made and they're really simply made and they're not actually even great because I'm not a, a tailor or anything, but um, I hand sewed them and I really love them and my kids love them as well. So I still want to show them to you because they've been with us for a long, long time. So this one, for example, um, the inside fabric is um, from an old jumper that I used to have. And I love repurposing things. And the, um, the outside is just a, a fabric I had lying around. So uh, first of all, I show you what's inside. Um, it's, they're my watercolors, Winster. Uh, Windsor and Newton and brushes, a pencil and black pens. Um, and there's some tissue as well. Very important. And a rubber. So um, all I did was like I made two pieces of fabric, um, long rectangles. Two time two pieces in the same size, um, with the two different materials, and I put them on top of each other, and I sewed along the edges, and then I just put a um, button there, and so you can close it. And I know things can fall out on the side, and my son has been complaining that this happens to his one, but um. I think it's okay. Like, I mean, of course, you can make more buttons than one. You can put more here. So this is my son's um, pencil case. And um, actually, this one, again, is made from... That's made from an old skirt that I had, a corduroy skirt. The outside, and I put a little pocket even here. Yeah, you can see leftover pieces from the skirt. There was like a fake pocket in it. And, 
Um, again, I used these like wooden buttons because I really like them. And I also gave him, he has um, watercolors. This is actually a new one that I just ordered. And a pen and brushes. And he also has black pens somewhere else. And he likes to also color things in with um, um, with colored pencils. And he really likes these ones. They're Waldorf pencils and they're, the colors are really vibrant and beautiful. You can also order them on Amazon. They're a bit more expensive, but I think they're so worth it. Um, he's been using them for years. And this is a, a new one I got him a few weeks ago as well. So, um, yeah, these are the things we use for nature study and for drawing in general. And, oh, I forgot to show you this one. I made this for my youngest son a few years ago. He doesn't really use it anymore um, because it's too childish now, I think. <laughs> but uh, that's just felt, the inside and the outside is like a, um, I think from a fat quarter, like a square. And um, inside I have, again, I have brushes and I have these as well, which are really good for um, sketching outside in nature or if you take them with you and you don't have um, a container for water for to use watercolors. So these already have water in them or you can fill them with water. There, you can just put a little bit of water in and then you close them and you bring them along on your sketching trips. And they come in different sizes. There's a bigger one and look, and you can paint with them. And if you want to clean them, you just squirt out a bit of water and just clean them down. And um, they're really handy to bring along. Yeah, so I hope you um, enjoyed today's video and I'm going to look forward to make a few more of these shorter videos uh, every day, probably taking a day off at the weekend as well. And um, and let me know as well what you want to see in the videos and I will see if I can make it happen. Okay, thanks for watching. Talk to you soon. Bye. Thank you.